Hello everyone, welcome back to the expansion channel. It's me Sitara and I hope all of you are doing absolutely great. In this video, I'm going to talk to you about how to get rid of anxiety or any other negative emotion. Anxiety and any other negative emotion surfaces up within our body when we're faced with certain situations or environments around us in which we feel out of control and which remind us of a previous event or trigger off in a subconscious way an event that then manifests as anxiety or negative emotions within the cells of our body. Anxiety and negative emotions can be conquered and if you try the techniques in this video I'm sure that it will help you. As human beings it's our divine universal right to feel good about ourselves, about each other and also about this planet. When we ultimately take responsibility for ourselves we can achieve such higher states of mind of well-being of connecting to our soul that we in turn achieve such a wonderful connection with the universe and such a wonderful sense of peace and upliftment in my life journey I have come across anxiety and I have come across moments where I have been so shy of certain situations that I've blanked out or I've completely seen black. Now this is because at that time I was very very young, I was very very sensitive and I was so in tune with things that I was able to feel things at such a deeper level which I still do now but in such a different way and back then you know I would experience blackouts or just complete panic attack from having to face situations which I knew would cause severe anxiety but the following techniques really really helped me and they made me help me actually to overcome that negativity of anxiety and just overturn it so that I become so much more confident and so much more peaceful and so much more radiant so I'm going to share with you these techniques because I'm pretty sure that it can help you overcome any issues that you have the first and most important thing about anxiety and any other negative emotion is to realize that it exists within you and it's come about because at some point in your life some event has occurred that has really traumatized you and because of that you know you're carrying around this excess baggage this worry this fear so you need to accept it and you need to promise yourself you need to promise yourself that you're going to be kind to yourself self-care is so very important in getting rid of anxiety you need to look after yourself by that I mean you know you need to do things that you love you need to connect with yourself you cannot talk badly to yourself or about yourself to other people it's okay to be humble but it's also okay to love yourself so you know self-care look after yourself speak kindly to yourself this can take practice for some people but it's so very important if you're going to achieve this higher state of balance and peace and equilibrium the next important step is to meditate. There are different forms of meditation. You don't have to sit there and be completely in silence and just not think at all. There are different forms of different meditations and you have to find one that works for you. I personally, you know, I use music meditations, visual med meditations. They really, really help me. So you can try a meditation technique that works for you and that will in turn allow you to focus your energy away from worry and stress not as a distraction but as a way of you to tune into your higher nature. Another important thing is diet and exercise. Now if you're eating a lot of junk food or if you're not eating a balanced diet that means getting nutrients from different places and different food sources and you know generally exercising, moving your body and intentionally doing it you know you will find yourself feeling really stuck really blocked really you know sort of stressy and worried and anxious so it's important that you you know work it out within your body and work it out within your soul people are all different and some people need more exercise more nutrients more things than others so you need to work with what you have and what works for you the next most important thing is to make sure that you're surrounded in a positive environment with positive people. Now I know in the real world this is not always easy but in my life I have found that if I have felt anxiety or panic it's usually because the people around me were so stressed out and so negative that I would feel that and I would take it as my own when it was not my own. So 
what I used to do is retreat and go to peaceful places, you know, peaceful people around me. And this in turn would affect me in such a beautiful way. And, you know, it's the tr same truth with everyone here on this planet. If you surround yourself with a positive environment, with a positive nature, with positive minded, like minded friends and people around you, then you will find that your life will really, really improve. And it gives you such a boost of energy. Many of the ascended masters and spiritual teachers on earth have experienced anxiety have experienced negative emotion but what they did was do these techniques I've suggested in this video and they've actually improved their lives and they've connected with their highest state of being which is all of our divine right here on earth this is what the expansion is all about trust the higher purpose trust the higher power and know that everything is working for your highest good you have to let go of any attachments for you to feel peace and to get rid of anxiety anxiety and negative emotions come about because at some point you felt attached to a certain belief or a system of ways in which things or life should be and you really have to let that go the whole point of the expansion or the spiritual realm is to actually let go of any closed-minded thinking and open up to experience a bounty a abundance of goodness and when you can do this when you can really allow yourself to do this you'll find that anxiety and stress and negative emotions would reduce in your life obviously stress and negativity is always going to be around us this is the state of this natural world but that doesn't mean that we have to buy into it and that doesn't mean that it has to affect our overall sense of happiness or worthiness it shouldn't so you know it's all about us taking our responsibility seriously seriously towards ourself and towards others as well. This all takes daily inner work and even weekly work. So work with what you have with yourself. You know, you can relax, just think about ways in which you can improve your life right now because there's always steps, even smaller steps that you can take every day that can help you go in the direction of what you want, which is peace and stability. There is nothing wrong with you for feeling negative emotions, anxiety, worry. These feelings are all part of the human states, but these are lower states. So, you know, to feel that balance, you need to rise above that and take your responsibility and love yourself unconditionally it's so important you do that because you would not exist as an idea as a thought as a physical if someone some higher form didn't think of you into existence so you're going to think that you're loved so much you're asked you're requested to be here on planet earth you're requested to be part of this grand scheme of things and you know feeling honored and and comfortable within yourself is part of that process so trust it and i really hope you've learned something in this video i hope it helped you please do comment down below subscribe like and share with others who you feel will benefit from this video i thank you all so much for listening and watching until next time take care goodbye